And so we're already starting the day. Um, I have a lot of stuff to do. You guys are cricket. Sorry about that. Um, I have a lot of stuff to do to get done before game time. And so I was just gonna bring you guys along with me and just kind of show you guys what a day looks like as a cheer coach. Um, we have an away game today and the game is about 40, I think it's about 40 minutes away. Game starts at six. The girls have to be at the school at 4.15. So I have to get everything that I need to get done before 4.15. Um, that includes cleaning out my car, making sure that the house is clean and the laundry is done, making sure Preston is ready to go and his stuff is ready. My aunt is actually gonna keep Preston tonight for the game. He's not gonna go because it's just a good little drive. He doesn't wanna go as you can see. He said he doesn't wanna go. So I'm not gonna make him go, um, but he's gonna sit with my aunt. So I have to make sure his bag and his snacks and everything are ready to go um, before the game. And um, you're not going to the game, okay? You are going to Nanny House. He calls my aunt Nanny because my aunt used to keep him like from the time he was six months all the way up until like last, no, yeah, this year, August, this school year. Um, so he calls her Nanny because basically she is or was his Nanny for a long time and still is at this point. Um, yes, that's your Nanny. So yeah, so I'm right now headed to the car wash to clean out the car, get everything clean. And then by that time, Preston and I will probably grab something to eat and get a little few things in the house, go home and clean up and start preparing for today. Okay. Where do you want to go? We're going to you're going to Nanny's house this afternoon before mommy goes to the game, okay? So the bus leaves at 4.45, um, but I have the girls get there around 4.15 just so we can make sure. You're not riding the bus. So I can make sure that um, everything is ready to go and they have everything they need. You know, everybody's there. Um, so that's why I have them get there a little bit early. So that's what we're working with right now. I'm about to get ready to turn on Lido and then yeah. Just wanted to check in with you guys. I will be checking in with you guys in the next clip. What color is that, Kristen? Blue. All right, guys, I'm back in the car. I've cleaned out the car since we last talked. We're about to go get some pizza and um, I cleaned out the car and I was going to Walmart since Walmart was right. You want some? There you go. Walmart was right next to the car wash. So I was like, yeah, I can just run right there to Walmart and get a few things for the house. And Preston, we pulled up in the parking lot. And Preston was like, Mom, can we please go to Target? I don't want to go to Walmart. So <laughs> we ended up at Target and we got some things. Now we're about to go to Nukes and get some pizza. And yeah, that should be fun. Huh? Huh? <laughs> I don't know what you're saying. Um, anywho, we're headed to Nukes to go get some pizza. The car is clean. Got some things for the house from Target. I was going to Walmart because if you're an educator, then you know it's the month of January. Yeah. Hey, Kristen. Hi guys, look who I have with me. <laughs> it's Mama Darius. Mama, have you been in? Yeah, you was in the last vlog. We will say yes. Yeah. So I just picked up my mom from her hair appointment. Look at her looking all bougie. Show your hair off, Mom. Oh, fancy. So we were going to Starbucks, but I have to take her to her husband now because she's about to. She, 
show you guys a little sneak peek of what I pack in my cheer bag as a coach um so it's just I'm trying to hide my, my school name <laughs> uh, first and foremost I keep this inside of my book bag basically it's just an essentials little small little handy little bag with hand sanitizer a mirror hand sanitizer and please be careful lip gloss lip liner, a MAC lipstick in red, and then travel size perfume, I think it's Jimmy Choo, it is, and then um, I also have my AirPods, so I'm going to get too overstimulated at the basketball games, just in case, sometimes I listen to stuff on the bus, today we have like a 40 minute drive, so I've already said that, anywho, that's all of that. <laughs> Dropping stuff, of course. What do you mean? And I got this little bag here, this little clear bag from. You have to go potty? Go potty from Hobby Lobby. All right. And then I have this for just notes. Um, it's just basically just a notebook. Um, that I have for you know just in case I need to write down anything so I won't forget and sometimes my shoulders give me like payments at the game and I don't want to like lose it and so I keep it like in my envelope there so I also have my wallet of course I need my wallet just in case I have to spend some money keep some cash too for the game mommy. just in case mommy. and then this is um what I well, I keep like my cheerleaders information, like Mama. just in case something happens, I have their parent contact um, and addresses and all that here, just so I have to carry my, my MacBook. Um, so I keep that inside of Mama. my, and basically it's just Mama. one of my um, old this happy planners. Printed it. out the names and hole punched it with my happy planner hole puncher and put, you know, just put it in there. I'm trying to hurry up because my son is about to be bad in the background. There's no items and stuff. I don't have to show that because obviously, you know, I'm going to be around girls. So obviously they may need stuff like that. Just personal items. Um, and then like a small first aid kit with like mandates and stuff. That's Mama. pretty much it. Oh. Alright guys, I'm dressed and ready for game day. I just have on this black jean jacket, flare leg jeans with some black boots. And yeah, simple, comfortable and pressing and screaming. So I am headed out the door to head to the school, get there before the girls, and guys, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Real fast, if you are a mom and you understand what I'm about to say, Preston has not took a nap all day. He missed his nap time. We went out to Nukes um, to eat lunch, and he was like kind of like not in the mood and ready for his nap, I could tell got home he got re-energized and just started playing with every single toy that he could find and now as I'm headed to the gym and before I'm going to the gym I'm dropping him off at my aunt's house he is asleep <laughs> I mean just it's two hours almost past his uh, nap time he normally goes to sleep around 12 o'clock each day and it's two o'clock and he is just now going to sleep and as you can see his little teddy bear thing whatever that little thing is i don't even know what the little stuffed animal is i think it's a zebra or whatever the little animal right there is just hanging on but if you are a mom or a parent then you understand <sighs> he's gonna wake up and he's gonna be like where's mom you guys in the next clip. Alright guys, we are on the bus. Say hey to the vlog. Hi. Everybody say hey to the vlog. Say hey to the vlog. Hello guys. So we're passing around snacks. Can I show you snacks? And I 
actually afraid to eat this. Okay. Definitely unhealthy. Definitely unhealthy. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna try this. I'm not really sure if I'm gonna be a fan. But yeah, as you can see they have on their face. Red lip is a part of the face. Shy shy. Alright, so we're about to get ready to head to the gym. I'll check back in in the next clip. Okay. Cheers. Okay, tell them what you did to your Stanley Cup. Um, I was deep cleaning it and it had bleach in there, so that was like white spots. <laughs> do not use bleach to clean your Stanley Cup. Don't do that. Bye, bye. <laughs> so exciting. All right, guys, we made it to the gym. And the game is about to get ready to start in just a second. I'm about to hurry up and get off because I don't want to get copyrighted. But I just wanted to check in. We are here at the game. Get there for you and get back on the bus. Get there for you and get back on the bus. Alright guys. 